morning from Romans chapter 10 everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved so glad you are here this morning to call upon God's name as you worship him as you hear his word as you receive the sacrament and may you be strengthened in faith faith that takes hold of every blessing of God's kingdom for you Faith that lifts you up in power to live, not in your power, not in the power of anything in this world, but in the power of God, the power that created the universe, the power that gives us victory over sin, death, and Satan. That power belongs to you as you call upon the name of the Lord. So glad you are here. And every service, here, here we are, here we are, early August, and place, 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 boy, thank you for being here. We, we don't take this for granted. We greatly appreciate it. And, and if you're visiting here, at every service God brings us visitors. And if you're visiting this morning, we rejoice that the Holy Spirit brought you here. And we pray that you not only hear about God's incredible love for you in Jesus Christ, we pray that you find that love shining brightly through everyone here. So for those who are physically able, if you'd be so kind as to stand up and greet those around you, especially anyone you may not know, in God's love. But when we leave here, we go into a dark and dying world. We go into a world in which people are overwhelmed with their own fears and worries and uncertainties. And they don't have hope. Oh, they act like they do. They put on a brave face or, or they hide in, in themselves or in another person or many of the things of this world. So that's why what we do here is so important. When we leave here, we leave here lifted up in the power of God to live and we pray for that power, we pray for that love, we pray for that hope to shine through us in everything we say and everything we do and it makes such a powerful difference 